We're at Epping Community Services Hub today. This place opened back in 2016 in partnership with City of Whittlesea and Brotherhood of St Lawrence. The vision of Epping Community Services Hub was to create a vibrant local place where service providers could benefit community. When I first came to work in the Hub, I was blown away by the idea of the collaboration. My first thought was this is going to be an exciting place to work and I would love this to work in other places. The Hub houses 21 partner organisations who deliver 50 programs to the local community. The services delivered include disability services, which help people access employment, family and drug and alcohol counselling, employment services to help asylum seekers, and a range of others. Having everyone in one building makes it um, very easy to collaborate. If the hub wasn't here, in this location in Epping, our program would not be able to continue running as it is. My name is Mina Abdelmaleki. I work for Brotherhood of St. Lawrence. I came to the hub to seek help to find a job. As a migrant and asylum seeker, English is not my first language. I was struggling to find a job. I got the volunteering with Youth Transition Program. I can gain the local experience and gain the employment skills through the volunteering job. I got the paid job with them and now I'm running the employment pathway program for asylum seekers at Brotherhood of St. Lawrence in the hub. For somebody who comes here, it can be like a one-stop shop. Let's say they come in saying, I need a job. But in the process of having that conversation with me, I might discover they're homeless. I might discover that they're struggling with depression and I can refer them to another service. I was referred to the Epping Community Services Hub through my GP. I didn't have a job, I wasn't in studying and I was having issues with mental health. The organisations worked together to basically create a plan for me to be successful in life. Yeah, and I'm very thankful for that. We have a cafe that's run by Ara Lewin, who trains people with low to moderate intellectual disabilities. The benefit of the cafe here is you're actually able to deal with the general public while still learning how to make a coffee, how to bake, how to operate point of sale. It just gives them that confidence and upskilling that they can stand up and go, oh yeah, I can have a go at that. I'm really happy at the cafe. My favourite thing is just doing um, making coffees. I like a customer. They are very nice. The Hub is a welcoming space. It's a safe place. I'm so passionate about it. We're helping community. I would 100% recommend that this be a model that be rolled out by this government doing this in Victoria. We're actually being quite innovative. I can't think of any reason why you wouldn't replicate this model in terms of delivery of services.